I'll show you how you can bring a simple image like this to life in minutes. So let's get started. Open the Google Colab document. I've left a link to the latest version of the forum Stable Diffusion in the description below. The benefit in using Google Colab over locally running Stable Diffusion is that you can borrow Google's GPU, which is considerably faster than using a normal computer. And it's generally less complicated, even if it might look a little bit intimidating now. Load the below settings, although if you have preferences and checkpoints, use the ones you normally use. You then select 3D mode, and here I'm going to use 100 frames for speed and then use wrap for my border. Strength affects how much your prompt will have an effect on this image. One will have no impact, and the closer zero it becomes, the more weighting your prompts and abstraction of the image becomes. Okay, for our image, we'll make some pretty basic prompts, and you want to pay attention to the section that says animation prompts. Now let's edit the dimensions of the video, 512 by 512 works best. I'm going to reduce the steps to 30 so it loads a bit quicker. Sampler Euler Central is my go-to, but I also use DDIM. Tick Use Init Image and select your strength. The higher the strength, the more it will look like the original image and vice versa. Let's use 0.7 for the moment and now we just render it. Drag and drop your file into the sidebar and copy the path. Whilst running your Google Colab document, you may find it crashes. You'll have to rerun the program if this happens, but if you upgrade to a pro account, you'll be able to save your progress. If running a free account, I find it crashes just after 100 steps, so keep them low and make sure your computer doesn't go into screensaver mode. So here's the finished product. In the future I'll maybe make more tutorials on the forum to explain more of these aspects and all of the other ideas that can be explored with AI.